The History of Online Counterfeiting To those of us who have been dealing with counterfeits for many years, the way counterfeiters operate on the internet is markedly different. You might even say that counterfeit operations were primitive compared to the sophisticated, internet sites that have prospered in this electronic marketplace. The earliest indications that the counterfeiters had discovered the internet, was wholesalers or factories offering to supply brand name products to buyers who operated in these informal markets. These sites were not easy to find and were difficult to prosecute since there was no physical inventory to confiscate or use as evidence. These early B2B sites were the start of the internet commerce in counterfeit goods. It wasn't until e-commerce became commonplace, with sites like eBay, Amazon and Alibaba, that counterfeiters realized that the internet could allow them to sell direct to consumers, through a global marketplace, which was largely unregulated and not controlled by any one legal jurisdiction. This shift to internet selling has dramatically changed how counterfeiters operate and how brand owners enforce their IP rights. The internet differed from early counterfeit selling in many ways, all favorable to the counterfeiter. 1. The internet provided anonymity. 2. The internet could reach a global consumer audience. 3. Prices could increase, thus increasing profits. 4. Counterfeiters could advertise their branded products easily. 5. URLs were easily obtained which incorporated brand names. 6. Enforcement is difficult. Brand Shield was established by brand protection industry professionals with a goal to develop cutting edge technology that will provide organizations a powerful solution to manage and protect their brand online. The Brand Shield system dramatically improves the way organizations can manage and protect their digital brand by providing the highest level of business intelligence for online brand management. Contact us for a free demo.